Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, we're going to answer a little more questions about Chrome OS Flex, that operating, operating system that Google has actually released that says it might actually be a good idea to use on old computers to kind of, you know, make them useful again. And of course, I've been using Chrome OS Flex on my uh, eight, nine-year-old uh, Toshiba laptop, and um, which has a Core i5 processor, but from 20, something like 2014. So uh, basically, it's about eight years old. And it works fine. Most of the options work great. And of course, a lot of you have commented over time about Chrome OS Flex, and here's a little video I made on my Chrome OS Flex machine about uh, the system itself. Now, um, remember that this is a work in progress because it's still in the dev. This is a dev channel, basically. This is a test software. It's not yet released officially. Um, so it, of course, is a work in progress. So if your computer is not compatible right now, remember that that doesn't mean it won't be compatible at some point. So check from time to time if you want to try it. You know, you just download it and put it on a USB thumb drive and try it. You don't even have to install it. Um, they, of course, have updates. A lot of people are asking me, are there security updates? Will there be updates to this? Yes, there are updates to this. Actually, on my system, the uh, Chrome OS Flex has had a couple of updates since it's installed. Um, last update was a couple of days ago where it actually was updated to one of the latest versions for Chrome OS Flex. So this is something to check out because it actually adds security updates. Remember when you have Google Chrome updates because of security, Chrome OS also or Chromebooks also need these updates because they also have these security flaws. So that is important to check out. So of course, like all operating systems, it contains updates and this is important to uh, apply on your system. So um, the latest updates, of course, are available uh, for Chrome OS Flex. So what you could do is uh, usually if you use Chrome OS Flex like all the time or regularly, it will actually pop up on the bottom right a little message saying, oh, you're ready for an update. But if you're not, you can go into the settings and you can actually go down into about Chrome OS on the bottom completely on the left. This will actually give you the ability to check for the latest version. As you see here, 101.4951.7 is what I have, and it says here the device is up to date. Now, every time there's a new version like this, there's also a possibility that some of the devices that weren't supported maybe have been added. So that's also a reason why you might want to try it if there is a update, because that will enable you to test out if maybe they've added drivers for your specific machines. So once again, this is a work in progress, but this is kind of nice. Also, I've had quite a few people that were curious about my comments saying, maybe you can use this on some old Chromebooks that weren't up to date anymore. It seems that there are a few of you that have tried to install it on some of the Chromebooks that you have that just can't get updates anymore, and it actually works. So that means you should try it. If you have an old Chromebook that is past its um, support date, you can try Chrome OS Flex and see if it works on it. That would actually give a new life to that old Chromebook. So um, it might not be every Chromebook that will let you do it, but those that will, well, could be kind of cool. So uh, Chrome OS Flex, that is a nice little system for old PCs pretty fast and um, you know it is kind of turning your old computer into a Chromebook basically and uh, for most people that you know just surf the web go check email do uh, a little bit of stuff uh, but not that much uh, probably enough to uh, have a nice working computer and uh, maybe revive that old PC that you have lying around doesn't do anything and uh, use it again for some purpose. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.